I am a massive hypocrite making this video, but we need to talk about your handwriting. So let's just put ourselves in the mind of your examiner for a second. They have been at work all day, they have come home, and they have a load of exam papers to mark. Loads and loads of exam papers to mark. They do with their kids, they do with their schoolwork, they make dinner, they maybe have a glass of wine, maybe two glasses of wine. Then they sit down and mark your exam paper. They are tired, they are grumpy. You need to make your exam paper as easy to mark as possible. Because if your examiner is trying to read what you've written and it's not very clear, well, they're not necessarily going to give you the marks. This applies to all subjects, but here are a couple of examples from science. So we have mitosis, and then a word that I can't read, so I'm not going to give you the marks. Alkane, and then a word that I can't read because I'm not going to give you the marks. You have to make your exam paper as easy to mark as possible. So that means clear handwriting and in maths, laying things out neatly, showing all of your working physics as well. Make your examiner give you the marks. It would be devastating if you missed out on those marks, those that grade, the couple of marks that might differentiate you from um, an eight or a seven, an A or a B. Um, because the examiner couldn't read what you're writing. Now I know, especially for some of the longer exams, which are two, two and a half hours, that your hand hurts. I know it does. Writing for that long makes your hand hurt. But it is still really important that you take the time to make your reading understandable. I'm not talking about spelling here, because in science, well, as long as I can understand it, I'm gonna give you the marks. Um, other subjects, English, that's more important. But make sure your examiner can read what you are writing. Make sure the examiner, there's no disputes about you getting the marks because of handwriting, okay? Again, you've seen my handwriting, you know it's not good, you know my spelling's not good, which is why I feel like a hypocrite writing while doing this video, but it is really important in your exam that your handwriting is readable.